As you may or may not have heard, Pastor John Richard Bell announced to the members of Central Baptist Church on Monday, the 5th of December, 2016, that he had turned in his resignation letter due to irreconcilable differences with the elders over a doctrinal issue. This brings to a close 20 years of Bible-based, Christ-centered, unashamed and unapologetic preaching of the gospel by Pastor Bell at Central Baptist Church. Since January 1997, Pastor John and Mrs. Miriam Bell have truly been used by God in amazing ways and have worked tirelessly and selflessly for Central Baptist Church. This video serves as a small token of our appreciation and gratitude to them for 20 incredible years at CBC. Thank you, Pastor Bell. Thank you, Pastor Bell. Thank you so much for the father that you have been. Thank you, Pastor Bell. Thank you, Pastor Bell. Hardworking, uh, caring, loving. I think those are the three words that I can describe you, Uncle John. Pastor Bill, I found him to be someone who is humble. Yeah. When you bring an issue before you to assist, he doesn't uh, rush to say yes or no, but always he said, let's sit down and talk about it. I think of the way your preaching on a Sunday has really helped me um, to apply Christian principles through the tough things in life. And I don't think you realize how much you've assisted me. Miriam, I admire you so much. You have been a role model for me in many areas of life. Um, very much so in the area of trusting the Lord, trusting the Lord for finances, trusting the Lord to supply all that we need. Pastor Bill, I want to just appreciate um, the way you uh, are faithful to God's word, the way you prepare your sermons so well. You've been my, my teacher for many years now, you go full central. And um, may God continue to use you, may you stay with, with us. I can't thank you enough for your good, solid, biblical teaching. May God the Father, by the Holy Spirit of His Son, continue to humble your hearts and cause you to be obedient to your calling, to shepherd, and, to shepherd the sheep of, with love and humility. John, thanks for all that you do and for all that you mean for us as, as your friends and congregants. Um, you're a loving example of faith in action and the love of Christ is clearly demonstrated through you, my brother. You've been very good friends. I wouldn't have grown to be the man I am today if you had not been part of my life. So I pray that we will continue to be part of each other's lives. And thank you so much. I remember how much you used to believe in people and make them feel like they truly belonged. I was just a mere teenager uh, when I was in the church, and yet you gave me opportunities in the youth group. You gave me opportunities in the main service to play the organ, despite all my many flaws and mistakes. You gave me opportunities to be friends with you and your family, and for that I am truly am blessed and grateful. I would like to thank you, Pastor John Bell, for teaching me that when choosing a song for praising and worshiping God in church, the words have to be biblical. If it is not biblical, do not sing that song, no matter how sentimental or how nice the tune is. Thank you for that treasure. I got this Bible from you in 2007, and in it you wrote that I should always seek to be like Christ. That's the biggest lesson I've learned from you. I thank God that you've been an arrow pointing me to Christ. You have affected my life in encouraging me to read the Bible as God's big picture. You kept the faith and I am sure God will help you to keep on keeping the faith.